Here in Florida, those who abuse animals will soon face harsher penalties under a new law. Ponce's law is named after a nine-month-old Labrador retriever puppy that was found beaten to death in Volusia County last year. ABC 7's Rick Adams joins us now in studio with more details on this law. Rick. Yeah, Jacqueline, good evening. This law will go into effect next week. Many animal lovers say it's long overdue. Pamela Moreau from is someone who is happy to hear about a new Florida state law where those who abuse animals will face stricter penalties. She was at 17th Street Paw Park in Sarasota with her dog Molly. Folks we caught up with at the park are all in favor of this law. I'm thrilled. I'm glad. I wish it was stiffer, but I'm glad that they're doing something. Under Potts's law, a judge will now have the power to bar someone convicted of animal cruelty from owning a pet. It also makes it more likely that an offender would go to jail and have a longer jail sentence. Karen Slumba is executive director of Animal Welfare League of Charlotte County in Port Charlotte. It's a place that has all kinds of animals up for adoption, including dogs, cats, kittens, rabbits, and even a pig. Slumba was one of the people in involved in lobbying for this law. Anything that we can do to keep people from doing that kind of thing to animals who are so defenseless. Slumba tells us her no-kill shelter does take in abused animals. She says it's something that's devastating to see firsthand. We work with the animals and, and try to um, gain their trust when they have been abused. Um, it often takes a long time. We're really grateful for our volunteers because our volunteers spend a lot of time with the animals. For Marrero Fromm and so many others at the 17th Street Paw Park, they're hopeful this law will help keep animals much safer. They're family members. Once you have a dog for a while, it's like having a family member. And Florida lawmakers did pass this measure earlier this year. Ponce's law goes into effect this Monday, October 1st. Jacqueline, back to you. Rick, thank you.